Alrighty, hello everybody, how are we doing today? I am doing great, and I've received three, wow, three offline follows from Jer RPG, Waterman956, and Becca Blue. Thank you all so much for the follows. How's everyone doing? Whew, it's been a while. Uh, for, those do, for those who don't know, I'm from Texas, and for those who are not aware, Texas has dealt with a nasty winter storm. And because of that, I had been without electricity and internet for quite a bit of time. Not so much on electricity, but just no internet whatsoever. Electricity, I had, you know, it was very spotty, although yesterday the uh, electricity was down for like the whole day. But internet, I was just without internet for like a whole week, so I couldn't stream. But here I am. It seems like the worst of it has passed. It's still really cold outside. And I don't have the heater on very high because um, whenever you deal with a, with a weather like this and there's a bunch of power outages, the energy bills usually skyrocket. So I'm still cold. I have uh, my blanket wrapped around me so I could stay warm. But um, yeah, so gonna be dealing with that for some time. Although it's supposed to start warming up after tomorrow, but right now it's still really cold. But the, like the, the snow and the clouds and all that, that has passed. It's, it's actually sunny outside, it's just really cold and there's still ice on the, on the ground and on the roads. So, I'm staying here. <laughs> and uh, another thing, I don't know how my internet is going to hold up. It's been fine today. There was a point earlier today when it did cut off. Bundle up folks, it's going to snow tomorrow. There was a time earlier where um, it did cut off for like a split second and then it came back. So there is a chance that my stream might cut off. And if it does, I'll try to come back. But for now, it seems to be doing okay. So I'll see how I can do. Uh, spirits are somewhat perturbed today. That is fine. Uh, I put something in here and I don't remember what it was. A chicken statue. Gunther can tell me more about this. So I was gonna go to the... Uh, uh, museum today so hope everyone's having a, a good day today it's been going okay over here I mean I didn't leave the heater off I did warm up a little bit but after I got it to like 68 I dropped it down to 64 and right now it says it's 67 so I'm doing okay uh, got you, bro I just need to get my bearings back it's been a really uh, strange week for me <laughs> Uh, hope everyone's having a, a good day, though. Got snow yam. Oh, he went straight for that water. I am so sorry. I didn't realize you needed it that bad. <laughs> Got a message on my phone. Probably going to be getting a lot of messages on my phone today, too. Everyone checking up on me to make sure I'm okay. A rusty spur. That goes to the museum. Yep. Anything else to dig out of the ground? How are my chickens doing? Have y'all gotten older? Looking a little thin? Looking a little grumpy? That's fine. Beep Bob. How you doing, Bob? Hope you're having a lovely day. It's really cold over here. <laughs> Definitely nothing compared to how it had been the past few days, but still cold. Now I'm just being more mindful of the uh, energy bill, so I've got to keep try to keep the heater low as much as I can. Uh, there's there's something up here. Uh, I got copper ore. Okay. So now there's channel points and subscribe to G two. Really, there are channel points. Uh. Well, I'm going to have to get all that set up then. Yes, I just hit affiliate recently. I had, I didn't forget that I hit affiliate. I just forgot about everything that kind of came with it. I don't have anything set up for those channel points, I don't think. So hey, accumulate them. <laughs> start building up those channel points until I start putting stuff in there. I almost forgot about that. I mean, with the crazy week that I've been having, the Festival of Ice has begun near Marnie's Ranch. Oh, snap, I totally forgot about that. Hi! I love animals, Mr. Rufus. If you treat yours well, I'm sure we'll become good friends. Do you like snow carrots? Thank you, this looks nice. Good, I'm trying to be your friend so I can get those pants. 
Festival of Ice, I totally forgot about this. Did I have to bring anything for this? I'm entering the ice fishing competition today. <gasps> There's ice fishing? I gotta do that. Oh, ice, a beautiful material to sculpt in, but so impermanent. Yeah, it'll die after today. I'm sorry, but carving ice parapets requires my undivided attention. I'll leave you to it. The forest looks beautiful in the winter, doesn't it? How's winter coming along for you, Rufus? Coming along great. Cold? Nah, I never get cold. Hey Rufus, are you going to enter the ice fishing competition? I didn't know that was a thing, so I might as well. There's a piggy here. <laughs> Alright. Uh, oh man, there's another rare crow. How much money do I have? Eight? Oh, I could actually buy this. Uh, what else is there? Can be placed as decoration. Frozen dreams, it's a furniture. Icy rug, blah, 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 blah. Ooh, cranberry sauce. Uh, no, I want that rare crow. I'm buying that. Good. $5,000 down the drink. <laughs> okay. I saw a big fish down there. I'm sure you did. Let's go talk to these people first. I'm not very creative when it comes to snowmen. Neither am I. Hmm, what kind of snowman should we make? A classic one. Carrot nose, top half of the scarf. Something funky. Icicle, antennas, pine cone eyes. Think outside the... Snowmen are boring. Think outside of the box. Honestly, I would... I don't know what this res... what this would result in, but I'm, I'm looking more at the think outside of the box kind of uh, uh, response. But I think I'm just going to go with something funky. Okay, that sounds like fun. Normally, I, I would say think outside the box, but I don't know uh, how that result would yield. I want to give him a carrot nose. Oh, you, you want to be the boring one. Emily started helping me without any provocation. Does that mean something? Go. Wow, the snowman needs a makeover. Who made this? <laughs> I plan on winning the ice fishing competition. Uh, you might want to plan something else because I'm joining. Snowmen are okay, I guess, but mostly I'm looking forward to the spring. Me too, like in real life. I guess winter isn't all bad. Playing in the snow can be fun. It was fun. The snow is so cold, I can't feel my fingers anymore. That's why you're supposed to wear gloves, dude. What do you think of my snow goon? Oh, uh... I mean, I'm sure it looks fine. He has his arm up and everything. hey yo. <laughs> Let's go see what these igloos are all about. Hey Rufus, ready for some ice fishing? Yes, and I'll do my best. Yes, and I'm going to beat you. To be honest, no, I'm bad at fishing. I'll do my best. That's the spirit. You know what? I probably should have worn a jacket. Yes, you should have. Extreme temperatures can put your body under a lot of stress, so make sure to bundle up. Sorry, there's no food. Oh, well, okay. I feel bad for all the poor coal animals out there. Is there anything over here? There's a birdie. Oh, Willy, way out here. Igloo buildings and art I picked up from the tundra dwellers who live beyond the frozen sea. All right, let's go back and talk to the mayor. Can I go in this igloo? No. I don't think I talked to y'all yet. If it was up to me, I'd probably have a pizza festival at the saloon instead. Hmm. Wife dragged me out into the cold for this. Did I ever tell you how George and I first met? He actually pelted me with the snowball in this very festival. Oh, that's adorable. over here. All right, let's go talk to the mayor now. Hey, mayor. Welcome to the Festival of Ice. The highlight of today's festival is the ice fishing competition. We set up this frozen lake and stocked it full of fish. Just let me know when you're ready to compete. Are you ready to participate? Yes. 
Of course. Let's do this. Where am I? I'm in the middle. All right, everyone, let's begin this year's ice fishing competition. Contestants, your goal is to catch as many fish as you possibly can in two minutes using the provided fishing rods. You must catch your fish here from these holes in the ice. Well, is everyone ready? Begin. Oh. I'm doing great. She caught a fish. No. No! That's not good. I don't need any funny fish now. I just need to catch as many fish as I can. Okay, three within a minute, that's not bad. Perfect. Does that count for two? No. <laughs> you think I'm gonna win? I hope so. Oh, I got broken glasses. Great, someone threw glasses in the pond here. So far I caught four. I haven't been keeping track of how many they caught. That's one for Willy. Come on! At least get me five. Get me five. That's all I want. Stop it! There we go. That, that should be five. Please at least give me the fish, even if the time runs out. Oh god, just in time. I hope. I hope that counted. Alright, so it's either four or five. I think I think I won. Otherwise, that's very luck-based. Wow, that's a lot of fish. I know, we're, we're good. Gag the smell. Oh yeah. I can only imagine. I've never actually been where there's a bunch of fish like that. Now for the winner of this year's ice fishing competition. Me? Willy, Ah! I guess it only gave me four. That's very luck based. I kept, kept catching algae in that broken glasses. That sucks. I wonder what the prize was. Well, that's it for this year's festival of ice. Thanks for coming everyone. Now let's release these poor fish. No, I wanna eat them. I guess it only counted four for me. Damn, that sucks. I didn't win the competition, but it was still fun. Time to head home. Yeah, I mean, I guess. Do I get to keep all the algae at least? No. Oh yeah, I have this rare crow. So I have three now. I have three now, cool. 10, 20, yeah, we'll go to bed. I need to go see Willy, or, uh, Gunther tomorrow anyway. Oh, that hurt. Okay, so it's supposed to snow today. And tomorrow, it's gonna be beautiful and sunny. Oh, cool. Perfect time to go, uh through the mines, so we'll take... Do I know how to make that super meal? Let's see. Probably not. Because I don't want to just eat those up if I don't know how to make them. Alright, well, we're gonna take some 
tortillas with me. Because I, I don't want to eat that if I don't know how to make them, because then I'll just run out. So it's snowing. Do they still need to be? Oh no! Don't don't kill them. They do. Okay. And at this point, I'm just getting a chub row a day. I see the holly there, I'll pick it up. Got two hollies. That I'm not gonna take with me to the the caves. Cause I if I recall that gives you negative energy. It might be good to sell, speaking of. Okay, I got a snow yam out of that. So he, he opens at nine. Oh yeah, these things. Uh, I need topaz to rub on my sword legs. Please bring that. Yeah, please bring one as soon as you can. I think I have a topaz. Do I have at least one star in the community center? I do not, but I am really close to it. I'm really close to one of them, and I forgot which one it was. And there's this one right here. All right, what do we got today? Uh, I've got the urge to make my famous giant omelet, but I'll need two dozen eggs. Any takers? I can't make eggs just yet. I'm putting on a little promotion just for one. If anyone can collect 1,000 pieces of wood in a week, they'll earn a reward and you can keep the wood. Now, do I have to actually collect the wood or can I just give her 1,000 pieces of wood? Why not? Why not? Let's do it. Collect? Okay. Well, I'm gonna be in the mines. I know I can get wood from that, so... Okay, this place opens at 9, and I'm here a little earlier than I thought I would be. Oh! I'll take that. No, I'm not gonna fish. I, I need to save a bunch of, uh, uh, as much space as I could. Man, I can't speak. Nine o'clock, here we go. Hey, I got here just as you opened. What am I getting? A chicken statue, okay. I also found a book, let's see what this says. The Secret of the Star Drop. For thousands of years, people have been intrigued by the mysterious powers of the Star Drop, but no one knows where they come from. Professor R.J. Cutler, a leading researcher on strange fruits, says this, We've discovered traces of genetic material on meteorites that closely resemble the star drop, but it's not a proven match. Regardless of where they come from, the peculiar fruit is said to be uncommonly delicious, and some even claim they grant special power to those who eat them. So, if I break that comment that came to my farm, will that reveal a star fruit? And if that's the case, I better get that pickaxe real quick, because I do want that star fruit. It's a statue of a chicken on a bronze base. The ancient people of this area must have been very fond of chickens. Rusty spur. An old spur that was once attached to a cowboy boot. People must have been raising animals in this area for many generations. Alright, let's break that geode so I can get those five stones that it's obviously hiding. And then I'll go to the mines. I'll get some wood that way, and then I'll figure out how to get the other pieces of wood. Hi, I got a geode. Give me those stones. There, there's gonna be stones in here, right? No, it's a, uh, what is that? Jamborite? Yeah. That's fine, cool. Oh, I can just go up here, right? I've already given this to Gunther, so... I actually think I have a few of those.
I'm already carrying more than I would like, but I can always eat the, the food. Hey, can you go find Haley and tell her I said hi? No, Alex, you can do that yourself. And get out of her way, too. Hey, if you need any materials or blue, blah, blah, blueprints, my shop is the place you're looking for. Hey, quick question. Do you like jamborites? Um, why? Oh, that looks pretty. It looks very pretty. I'm sure you can make it into something if that's what you're looking for. Oh, there's a thingy here. Oh. Another thing to give to Gunther. Anyways, let's go in here. And let's get- oh shoot, I forgot. I'm in the fire part. The- the fire area. Alright, let's see how I do. Oh, what the hell is this? Looks like something from Binding of Isaac. Void Essence. That little red square is still not in the right place. I think that update may have messed something up. Come on, bats. Alright. Ooh, little jelly. And there's a guy hiding in a rock there. Oh man. Got a lot of health there. Get away. Okay, not gonna lie, these guys are taking a lot of hits. That's gonna wear me down a lot more than I can get that I would like, even with all the food that I have. You're gonna like what level 100 has to offer? Oh dear. What is this? Whoa, what the? What just happened? I don't know what you hit me with. I don't know what that sad effect is, but I'm actually dying. Shoot. Okay, that didn't give me as much health as I would like. That's more of an energy thing. Ooh, I got a gold bar off of him, though. Emerald, nice. Oh, I found the, uh... The stairway. Anything else? Don't think I have anything else to break, so let's move on. You think a gold pickaxe can break the meteor? Well, I'm getting gold now, so I'm in the right place. Oh, bats are already on their way here. simple, you, uh, kill the Batman. Oh, he had the stairs. Cool. Yeah, I think I'm gonna need, start, need a better weapon really soon. This is not doing a lot of damage anymore. These guys are getting pretty bad. I'm gonna die, no! Get me out of here. Oh, yeah, eat it, go, 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 go. Get out of here. Whew. How much does this heal me? I'm on floor 84. If I could just make it to 85, I'll be happy. That was close. How does a bat have a letter? I have no idea. I have no idea what the status effect is, but it's gone now. This guy. Get away. It's hard to push him back. Okay, there's a ladder right there. Slimes. Ooh, 48. There you go. White algae? How much does that heal? 
Not a lot. All right, I'm at 85. Let's get out of here. I need a. Uh, I need some better stuff. I'm gonna die down there, and I'm gonna lose some stuff if I die. That's not good. Have I completed any challenges here to get me some better stuff? Need a new sword? I didn't do everything, dude. Um. Oh, I'm. I only need to kill six more Duggies. Those are at the very beginning, though. Hell, I need to kill six more Duggies, though. I don't know what they'll give me. All right. Well, first of all, how do I go down? All the way down. Um. Well, that give, that's ten thousand dollars, so I definitely don't want to get rid of that. But I need something that is more damage. I also don't think I have any rings. Let me see. I have one, which slightly increases your radius for collecting items. I mean, that's fine if I want to collect items, but if I want to survive, I'm going to need something better. Like this. This does 8 to 15. Oh, that does 10 to 20. It increases my speed, and it also increases my critical. So I need something that does more than 10 to 20 damage. Like that, but that... It's really heavy. Lowers your speed. Templar Blade. Here we go. It once belonged to an honorable knight. That I'm gonna want. $4,000. I, I can get that. That's not too much of a problem. Oh, this is even better, but $6,000. But more importantly, I need to increase my defense, and I see that here. It's like Firewalker, but I think I already have that, though. Yeah, so that's... I guess that's not a problem. Dark... Oh, no, there's Dark Boots. Okay, so I'm gonna have to start buying some of this stuff now. It was all easy up until this point, and I get it. And I also need to kill more Duggies. What time is it? It's only 5 o'clock. Alright, I'm gonna go to the easier levels and kill those Duggies. I don't think they'll hurt me that much. Famous last words. Watch. <laughs> okay, so this would be like the perfect floor for them to show up. Inventory full. Well, I don't want to give up any of that. Well, you know what? No. I do want to give up this. And I'll eat the algae. I have a bomb. Okay. Come on, Duggies. There's none here? Great, now that I'm actually looking for them, they don't show up. Worried about copper. Wow, okay. It's like now that I'm actually looking for them, they don't show up. I just need to kill, like, what, six of them? Oh, here we go. Oh, whoa, I've actually never. This area is infested. I've actually never seen this before. Oh, you know that mission where I was trying to kill all the slimes? This would have been perfect. Oh, there's a big old slime. Okay, I was I was just talking about how nothing's gonna kill me here. I'm actually a little concerned. Oh, okay, that wasn't too bad. Is that an amethyst? It has a skull symbol. What did? No, I don't wanna eat that. That is an amethyst. All right. The floor number. It does have a skull symbol. I guess because the area is infested. I've actually never seen this before.
Another amethyst, wow. No Duggies here, though. A way down has appeared. There's one. Oh, there's two. Cool. There's a geode right there. Um, I can eat this. There's another one. That's an earth crystal. Okay, so I got four of those things killed. Five. Here's five. Oh, here we go. Here's six. Alright. That did it. That's all I wanted to do. I hope they're still open. Uh, and I realize I probably won't be able to hold it, so let's get rid of our uh, stones. Please be a good reward. A hard hat. Keep your dome in one piece. I don't think that's going to do anything for me right. Oh well. Oh well. I at least completed a challenge. I know that's a trophy is to complete all these. Ooh, that includes 1,000 slimes. Also, my phone's buzzing. Do I have my uh, sound turned off? I do. Okay. All right. It is 9:20. Let's head back. Well, I got a hard hat for killing all those duggies. Makes perfect sense. Seriously, every time someone walks, they sound like they have wet slippers on. I also need to see if I have a topaz, and I need to start collecting some wood. I don't think I collected any wood that entire time that I was down there. How bad. First time I ever got Jade. Yep. Forgot to put the coal up. But hang on to the Jade and Emerald. It's the first time I got either of those. Um, this I got salmon berry jelly uh yum still trying to figure out what the jellies are for Algae gets me a lot, but I haven't been selling anything lately. I need four thousand dollars, so um, I don't have any other tomatoes, do I? water in the bowl again. Don't want my kitty to die, especially during winter. That would be embarrassing. I 
I wonder if hats give you like defensive in any way. You would think they would, like helmets. Oh yeah, they g gave me 25, that's not bad. Tomatoes give you 90 and, well gold star tomatoes give you 90 and gold star peppers give you 60. Oh, it's only day 10. I thought I was a little further in the winter. Should be sunny today. Okay, they're mildly perturbed. <gasps> all right, got all this stuff, wow. Oh, I keep forgetting I have that there. Um, keep that there and keep that there and the rest of these. Wait, is flour. I might want to put flowers in the other plate, in the other, in another chest somewhere. have a field snack in there. Got to take these to the museum. Wait, I, I hear the, that footstep of someone walking. Unless it's my cat. Do you make that sound when you walk? Yeah, okay, no, you make that sound when you're licking your paws, okay. Oh, pomegranate, dude. Pomegranate, that's nice. I'll take that. Alright, I need a plot like how I'm gonna set this farm up. Now that I can like water plants five units away. <gasps> they got a little bigger. Timmy Bell's looking a little thin. I don't know, he looks a little bigger. Jiki looks grumpy. How much hay do y'all have now? 74. Y'all are not eating up the hay. Alright, I'm gonna start breaking this up. I'm gonna figure out like how I want to design my farm. I'm doing this. This I'm actually going to leave here. And 
and I'll figure it out. But I gotta go see uh, Gunther at the museum. I also need to go to the beach and collect more corals and urchins and whatnot. I haven't done that for a few days, so there should be quite a bit to collect there. people here. All right. Got a reward. Not bad. What did I get? I got an obsidian vase. Nice. We get start to get some good stuff, like good decorations from him. Hi, is, is it boring to be a farmer during the winter? Eh. Miss Penny says I have to read this book before I can go play. Out in the snow? You know what? I should make the children. I should take the children on a field trip sometime. Maybe to the forest. Dot dot dot. She's really into her studies. I see. All right, jade, a pale green ornamental stone, a precious stone with a brilliant green color, and this is definitely a mammalian uh, skull. The forest is a wonderful place. Have you been there? I don't think I have. Let's go to the beach next. I need to also see if I have a topaz and I need to start collecting wood. Okay, I got some clay, not bad. Ooh, lost book, nice. Nothing else to collect or do. Oh, there's a clam up here. Nothing else to dig up. The library has expanded because I found a single book. Ain't it great? That is such a small library. Let's go read what that book has to say. Yay, y'all are done with your studies. All right, Journey of the Prairie King, the smash hit video game. Did you know anyone who beats Journey of the Prairie King is automatically entered into a drawing for a special prize? Really? Did you know the developer has stated that the protagonist is based on a real life character? A true cowboy hero from a prairie island in the Gen C. Huh, that's that little video game I think you play in the, uh, the bar or the saloon. I've only played it like one time and I was like, okay, I'm good to go. There's a trophy to beat that game without losing a life. And it is it is an extremely rare trophy, so I'm, a I'm assuming that's really hard to do. Either that or not a lot of people attempted it. They do it once and they're like, okay, I'm good to go. Snow yam. Okay, let's go see if I have that topaz. Oh, hey, you're the mayor. What are you doing here? I'll still come by every night to collect your produce, even in the snow. That is some true dedication right there. So you're the one who's collecting all the broken glasses and junk that I'm putting in there too. I am so sorry. <laughs> Alright. 
Topaz. Let's see if we got one. I only have one. He told you when you first arrived at Stardew Valley, did you not know? I'm sure he did. I have terrible memory though. You could tell me something like 10,000 times and I'll be like, oh goody, and then forget like the next minute. Put these up for now, I'll figure out what to do with them later. Okay, so I got the topaz, now I, need, I just need to see, is it Linus who's asking for it? Yeah. Oh, hello. I guess winter is a good time to work on my gadgets. Hi. Hey there, Rufus. Are you in here? Uh-oh, I seem to have lost him. That was weird. How it transitioned. It just kind of like, it just like, just kind of popped into screen, at least on my end it did. Nothing here. I really need to like check up on Linus, find out where he is. So if he's not at his tent, where does he like to hang out? I don't think I, I actually know that. You know, he could have been to the east, closer to the mines. I know I've seen him there before, I think. He doesn't come to the saloon, does he? I don't know if I've ever seen him there. Where does he hang out on Wednesdays? Also wearing wet sandals. Are you over here? Like over here maybe? Hmm. He normally doesn't stray far from this area. I've never actually like gone out of my way to look for him ever and I kind of feel bad about that. Oh, there you are. Hey, you came back. Hello, Rufus. You brought me the item I asked for. It looks perfect. Here's a little something for your trouble. $240. Let me see something right quick.
Nope, that didn't count. How about this? Nope, that doesn't count. So I really do gotta collect, like actually collect it. It's just like the other quest. Ah, all right, well, um, man. Well, in that case, it's 920, I got some time. Okay, I can't break that, not yet. Give me incentive to break more of these trees. So I guess I'll start focusing on that tomorrow. Can I break this one? I can. Oh, it gives you hardwood though. I don't think that counts. to bed and we'll start cutting more trees tomorrow. I didn't sell anything, did I? Oh yeah, I got all those corals and stuff. Holy cow. It was all right here. Um, Just normal sea urchins give you $160. That Because the gold star ones give you a ton, like 250 I think. Something like that. They give you a lot. Uh, crystal fruits give you a lot too. Damn. All right, got me $2,000. That's pretty good. All right, let's chop down some trees. It's gonna snow tomorrow. There's some annoy- yeah, it would make sense to just chop down some trees anyway. I'll actually keep that with me for energy. We'll see how these guys are doing right quick. <gasps> I got an egg! All right! But you're a little grumpy. How do I increase their hearts? Got an egg, though. All right. I think I'm going to build a shed next. Some good energy right there, not bad.
do I have now? 291? You see a mushroom? Oh, I do too. Up here. Can I pick that up? I don't want to break it if it gets bigger. Unless I'm supposed to chop it. Like, chop it out of the ground. I'm getting a lot of sap, too. What is that? now? Yep. Alright, almost halfway there. Wow, that's a funny looking tree. Oh, my energy is getting really low. Actually, I need to stop. Get some food right quick. that egg, but I'm not going to eat it. I want to hang on to it. Uh, that, wow, I got a thing of coal. Ah, nice. Tried to put that up and it just didn't let me. Looks fainted. He's asleep, but I do need to give him water. Thank you for reminding me. There you go. Made some, gave you some water. <laughs> Poor thing. Gave me a lot of acorns. A train is passing through Stardew Valley. Wait, where's the train exactly? Up there, up there. We gotta go up. We gotta go see what this train's all about. back for that later. Don't get hit by the train, right? Oh no, it left. It left! Dang it. It's an empty box. I guess I gotta be quit, like near the area when it shows up and then just like, it seems impossible to budge. Oh, found another book. Wow, someone's really been bad about misplacing their books. Hey Linus, oh, I guess you hang out here too. I missed the train. Oh, cool. More food. I think that's food. Yeah, you can eat it. Salmon berry. Ooh, I got two. 
Got more food. I don't think they give you a lot of energy, though. There's a thing here. Clay. Oh, shoot. I'm going to lose that wood if it's over on that side. I got it. More food. Oh yeah, I was, I was chopping this tree down before I went back to get more food. Well, let th I'm actually going to leave those little trees alone so they can grow. I also see I have some pine cones in the ground, so... Where am I at? 570? Okay, I'm about halfway there, and I still have four days left. So, I think that'll be enough tree murdering for the day. Got a lot of acorns and pine cones, at least. <laughs> I mean, even if I kill the little ones, I can always just replant them. That's not a problem. Put the winter root there. Daisy, what are you doing? What are you doing, girl? Probably a little uncomfortable. I'm sorry. We'll put the egg in here. That's where it belongs, right? You know what, we're gonna make another salmon berry jelly. And I'm gonna sell this one and see how much it gives me. Because I remember salmon berry itself does not give me a lot. Can I sell this? I can! Wow. Okay. Well, I wanna see how much that gives me. If that gives me a lot, then I found a new purpose for the salmon berries. What am I thinking about right now? I got a pumpkin. All right. Let's see, it's 520. What do I have in here? Uh, have I given Emily an aquamarine yet? I have not done that. Wait, so guess what? We're gonna find Emily and we're gonna give that to her. I just, pa I'll, I'll come back. I just saw the little, uh, they look like hairs sticking out of the ground. <laughs> Six o'clock just about, so is she already at the saloon? She loves it. Awesome. She's so easy to please. I love that. My dad is in the military fighting against the Gotoro Empire. That's why he's not here. Really? Wow, that's some that's an interesting backstory. Tell me more. He's coming back soon though. Oh, or let me guess. Is that the story he told you and he just never came back? I'm sorry. I need a little, little warm me up to be ready for another cold night on the ocean. Yeah. What are you selling today? Blueberry tart? That That's actually really yummy. That's actually a really good price. I'm gonna buy that. Oh, it's one one per. I thought it was, I thought it was, uh, 300 for three. Never mind. Well, I have blueberry tart now.
Ooh. Oh, this is that one fish. Oh no, I'm, I was getting so close. Come on. Oh, shoot. Okay. Okay, you just gave up. Thank you. Oh, it's a squid. Well, I already gave one to Willie, so I guess I get to keep one now for myself. Wow, that was definitely a lot harder than the first squid I caught. There's nothing out here. All right. I thought it was that other fish, the, uh, I forgot what it was called. The other fish that had like a similar pattern every time you try to catch it. Not forget this guy over here. Another book. Thank you. Hey, thirty. Want to get my energy back up? so I can get the rest of the wood that I need. Ah, you didn't get a lot. $60. Well, that's definitely not worth keeping it in the little, uh, the thing for. It's not worth it. Well, let's see. Um, here we go. Salmonberry itself gives you, uh, five dollars and the jelly gives you 60. I mean the markup is really neat but if I made more of these if I made more of these then it would probably be worth it if I put like 10 salmon berries in there and got 10 things of jelly out of it it probably would be a lot more worth it but with just one not so much and that's why I want to build a shed so I could start taking all these chests and all those little all those like maker machines and putting them in there it's going to be clear and sunny tomorrow I think it's snowing today huh. yeah oh wow this Rufus, I am researching the forgotten art of shadow divination. I require an item known as Void Essence. Bring it to me and you will be rewarded. Hey, I got one of those. Cool. That that message looked really cool, being all dark and everything. Okay, but I gotta collect more wood. I wanna finish that before the timer for that runs out. Once I get a shed, I can like really organize everything too. Play, okay. Battery's doing good.
There's my kitty. How you doing? Checking out, see what I'm doing? I have 784. Don't eat that mushroom. Oh, you jumped. <laughs> what is this? Okay, well, it gives you wood. Man, I really don't want to break all these little trees, though. Do not get hit by a falling tree, whatever you do. I can always chop trees down in the little meadow down south of me, so I'll start heading over there. Oh, there's some wood up here. But I need some energy first. I may have some trees up north, actually, northwest, actually. doesn't give you a lot of energy. Shoot. Eh, alright, whatever. Any trees down here or did I chop them all down? There's a thing here. More clay. I can chop these trees down. I know they regrow. Oh, okay. Random pine cone. tree should do it. Yep, there we go. Cool. I don't have to talk to her or anything. That's that's just it. All right. Well, now that I got all this wood, I need to see how, what all I need to build a shed. And while I'm at it, I guess I can upgrade the axe. Just get it up to iron. So I can finally break those pieces of wood. Um, it's over here. Uh, iron. Because I got quite a bit of money for that. Since I'm not going to be chopping down any more trees anytime soon. My energy should be fine now. I don't think I'm going to exert any more. I mean, really, what I should be getting is uh, that backpack upgrade, but. Eventually, I'll start making like more and more money, especially during springtime where that won't be an issue anymore. Hey, a crocus right there. 
I am interested in upgrading one of my tools. 30%? Okay, no, I definitely- I do want this one. Thanks! I'll get started on this as soon as I can. It should be ready in a couple of days. Cool. Let's go see, uh... What I need to build a shed. Oh, it's probably not even open. 320? I'll come back for that. Hi, Sebastian. How's it going? Nope, you're here. Cool. Uh, construct farm buildings. I need... Shed. Oh, $15,000? Dude! I definitely have the wood for it. Oh, wow, that's a lot of money. Never mind. I'll make do with what I got. I might want to start getting that, actually. Uh, $6,000. Comes with an incubator and unlocks ducks. Maybe that's why the chickens aren't happy, because I'm pretty sure I could put them in that big coop. A home for a friend. A home for a friend, all those. Okay. So I can't quite do that. Will it cost me money to move my fish pond? That's still there, right? Okay. Um, maybe once I like design my farm, redesign it, I'll decide if I want to move this because I kind of want to put the shed here in this area. Maybe. Or maybe I'll put it closer to the uh, cave here because I'm, I want to use that shed to put a lot of those uh, jelly, the jelly machines, and they produce all kinds of fruit. I don't know. We'll see. I'll figure. I'll figure it all out. Uh, what do you have though? You have wood, stone. Insert a piece of hardwood to break it down to regular wood. Mini fridge. Allows you to store additional ingredients for cooking. So I could probably put those in like my shed or something. <laughs> Telephone. Can be used to check store hours and inventory. Really? That actually sounds pretty useful. So I don't have to like keep coming here. I could just like check up. I like how the floor TV is. I like how the budget TV is more expensive than the floor TV. Oh, whoa, that's a lot. Provides unlimited access to almost every furniture item from the convenience of your home. I like how it's a catalog. Like, there are places in real life that practically give these away for free just to, you know, shot, like look at the furniture they have on display. She's selling it for $200,000. Man, you know you're, you're making it in life if you actually sell something like that. Oh, here we go. Some recipes. Can't eat any of these, though. Alright. Yeah, that's a lot of money to make a shed. Never mind. I might start working towards that backpack after all, so I can hold more. Give me that. Might as well see what it, I have here. I think it's this one I'm almost done with. Yeah, it's this one. I need, uh... I just need any three of these. And these look like they're all found in the, uh, the desert area, but I, I don't have access to that. This, this uh, fixes up my greenhouse, so I need to start working on these quite a bit more. Um, I have a few of these. I could just take these and bring them here. Jelly. I wonder if it, like any kind of jelly works. 
I have a pumpkin. What is this, a yam? I don't know if I have a yam, though. All right, so come springtime, I need to focus on growing some green beans. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm actually, I'm gonna upgrade my farm to where I'll grow just about anything anyway, so that's not a problem. Which one's the one that has the, the bus, the desert bus? Is it this one? Friendship. Bus repair, this is the one that just requires a lot of money. All right, so I, I just need money to get the desert bus repaired. That's, then I can start getting more of that exotic fruit and stuff. Crocus right here. Hi, Mayor. I hope things are going well for you on the farm. It's coming along. I got a lot I need to do still. And I'm starting to realize I need a lot of money, a lot more money. Did I check up here? Thermostat still says 67, so clearly I've hit equi <laughs> equilibrium on the temperature in my apartment for right now. Whoa, what the? I got a warp totem to the mountains. Cool. That was pretty cool. I know. That was awesome. So I can't quite put it up. Oh, I can't put this up either. Shoot. Um... I may want to start getting rid of some of this stuff because I'm never going to use it again. Like, I'm never going to use that again. Um, well, eventually I'm going to want better boots, so I'm going to get rid of all these because I can always rebuy them and I don't think I need to hang on to them. I wonder if I can sell them. No, I don't think I can. Nope. I'm going to hang on to them. Maybe I could sell them back to the uh, those people in that shop. Otherwise, I mean, what's the point of having them? But I do not want to get rid of these CDs. No, 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 no. I'm collecting these. Oh, and same thing with these. I don't need these anymore. How do I get rid of these? Do I just go back and sell them to those people? Well, you know what? Let's try that. It's still 620. And I got food for energy just in case my energy starts to deplete. Otherwise, I guess I'll just keep like a dresser or something of all my clothing and swords and stuff. I mean, it's not so much I'm looking for the money. I'm just looking to, like... I mean, it would be nice to get some money for it, but... I just need space, that's all. Okay, I'll also break this. I can't even reach it. guys I can I think I can probably won't even give me a lot but hey a hundred dollars 150 150 150 okay I got some money for it oh whoa this is twenty thousand dollars never mind thank you so much for giving this away to me I mean you gave me this too and it's ten thousand Any of these, like, increases your defense or something? No. The, these give you defense. 
I think that's really important right now because I was getting my ass kicked. But I'll be back here, like, a little bit later. I do want that Templar Blade, though. It once belonged to an honorable knight. pops up here at night in the winter. Oh, fishy, go up. Come on, fishy, go up. Thank you. Gotcha. You are a uh, perch. Okay. And I got... Oh, hello. 1526. Is that actually better? Yes, it is better. It is a better weapon. Holy cow. As a weapon. Sure, it doesn't increase my speed, and it doesn't have as high of a crit chance, but it does increase in damage. Alright. Cool. I'm so glad I did that. <laughs> uh, uh, but it doesn't, it doesn't have like a swinging motion. I guess I'll figure out if that makes a difference. It's like I impale you. We'll see how much damage it does. We'll see how it works. All right, pretty cool. Got a new weapon. I guess I'll start focusing on my defense then. Forgot to sell that crocus that I had in my inventory. Uh, it's going to be a beautiful sunny day. Ah, come on. I wanted to actually go to the mines today. Hello. Hey Rufus, congr uh, congratulations on completing my little challenge. I'm impressed. As an added bonus, I've included the blueprints for a new type of chest. Enjoy. Stone chest. P.S. Now that you have all those resources laying around, why not swing by for some construction work? Yeah, but I don't have $15,000. I want to build a shed. That's what I want. I meant to sell this crocus. And sell these bullheads. I can get a bunch of small mouth basses normally, so I'll just sell those too. Y'all actually eating this now? No. But do y'all have any eggs for me? Don't see any eggs, alright. Spice berry. Yep.
Sell that amaranth. Sell these two spice berries. I don't, if I recall, the spice berries don't give you a lot, but it is what it is. Mostly trying to free up space. Yeah, I should get some money for that. I might still go to the um, caves anyway. I just want to see how this Triton works. Because, I mean, I don't have an axe. It, that's being upgraded at the moment. The wizard, Rasmodius, wishes to study the arcane properties of the refined quartz. You will be rewarded. I should have one. I'll go ahead and take that. I should have one. Whoa, what the? Huh, that's weird. Huh, interesting. Uh, yeah, that one's already been done, so that's gonna be a while until that upgrades. Alright, let's go to Demines. So, you have a regular attack, and then you have, like, this jab? Nice, Sebastian. It's like the third time he's passed me at the same time that I've headed up here. Are you stalking me by any chance? I mean, I wouldn't mind, but... Can this break? I did it! I broke this. What's over here? Hey, who are you? Vivi? A dwarf. Owens Palantis in Moot. Oh, pfft. just stab him. I think I need those dwarven scrolls to be able to speak to him. And this is just not working right. Yeah. We're gonna go to 85. That looks like 83. Alright, we'll see how I do. no one here to kill me. That's good. Ha! Ah, here you go. <laughs> that was easy. Whoa, what the hell? Get me out of there. Oh yeah, that does like attack him multiple times. I kind of like that. All right, I'm already liking this weapon. Where is... All right, I'm starting to like this trident a lot. See how it does on these bats. These guys are the ones that really hurt. Okay, it just straight up kills them. But that also hurt me a lot. Dude, Dude it, it. Okay, these bats just hurt a lot. These guys just hurt a crap ton. I'm able to, like, handle them a little bit better now, but the fact that these guys just hurt so much. I need to work on my defense. This is not going to cut it. I mean, I can finally kill them easily now, but... Oh, you only gave me a copper bar.
All right, I mean, I can now kill them a lot easier, but I still get hurt a lot. And there's just no other way to look at it. I do need to work on my defense because I will not survive deeper in the mines without it. <coughs> Greetings. But I do like the weapons, so I can hold on to that. Thank you for the dark boots. I'm gonna need that. Lowers my immunity, but my defense goes up. I wonder what plus one defense means in the mines, though. But I'm not, I'm not gonna go back. I'll go back later. Hey, Abigail. <laughs> Just impale her. <laughs> it's the weekend. Yes, uh, is this Topaz? Do you like Topaz by any chance? Hey, how'd you know I was hungry? The hell? Abigail, we need to talk. Y you don't eat topazes. It doesn't look like cheese. We need we we, we need to talk. I hope I hope you're doing okay. Are they feeding you? I kind of feel sorry for her. Is is that like are her parents feeding her? Can't talk to you. Damn it. There's a holly right here. I know it's got negative energy, but do you like hollies? Uh, I'm sorry, but I absolutely hate hate this. I'm glad you love it. I'll be sure to give you more. Gosh, she's hard to please. That or I'm just not gi I'm just clearly not giving her the right gifts. Speaking of, um, I'm almost at five hearts with Linus. There are some people I really need to work on that I haven't been. Oh, Dwarf, you can give him stuff, I guess. Huh. I guess I gave him those Dwarven scrolls. That'll be my guess. You're okay? You're asleep? Yeah, did I give you water? I did. <laughs> give her a topaz and she eats it. Like, are you okay? Are you eating? I forgot to sell it. Well, I'm not gonna sell that right now. Actually, you know what? I can make another one. I've been keeping this with me forever. I use this with the cave carrots to make those uh, roots platters, which increase your attack, so I know how to do that. I wonder if there's anything that can increase your defense. Oh, I could make a fried egg. I don't have the egg on me. Oh, I guess uh, if it's in the fridge, then you can still make stuff with it. That's pretty cool. Is there anything that I can make that can like increase my defense? You can get better at farming, you can get better at foraging. This can increase your attack, yeah. You can get better at mining and magnetism. You can get better at fishing. Foraging, farming, 
Doesn't seem like there's anything that increases your defense. You can get better at attacking, but you know, if someone hits you, you still got hit. Wow, pizza gives you a lot of energy. All right. Well, maybe there's something I haven't learned how to make yet that increases your defense. There's always that. Also, Marnie, how far am I with you? There you are. Two hearts, so that means I should be able to enter that room. Is it two hearts or three hearts? I guess we'll find out. I can finally get the mayor's shorts and then go see the mayor. <laughs> I've been hanging on to that mission forever. Uh, thermostat dropped to 66. Okay. I guess it's starting to get a little cooler outside again. Can I go in here? I can. Let's do it. You found the lucky purple shorts. Better return to Lewis. <laughs> What's this game rated E10? Oh wait, there's a crocus here. Squeak, 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 squeak. Hi, I got your shorts. You found them. Where? Oh, um, <laughs> there? I have no idea how they could have gotten there. <laughs> this stays between you and me, got it? Yeah, sure, sure. <laughs> I finally finished this, this uh, mission. I got $750 for it. Yeah, that'll keep me quiet. I still need to find the pale ale. I still gotta get to the bottom of the mines, and I gotta find out that shadowy figure. Oh, bring the wizard of dark essence and give him a refined quartz. Wow, those are still going. Okay, refined quartz is... Do I have it? I hope I didn't give that away. Did I take that to the museum? I have a regular quartz. No, wait, hold on. It's, it was something different, wasn't it? Yeah, it's right here. It's a resource. And what else was it? Refined quartz and void essence. All right. I hope the wizard's still in his uh, house. 710? He should be. I hope. Oh, do not kill my chickens, whatever you do. Yeah, I'll, I'll chop you up. He's just sitting there with a smile on his face. Like, he, I, I, like he knows what he did. <laughs> Another lost book. Got a lot of things I need to read at that library. Got some clay. Hi. Beware you're standing above a potent magical field. Yeah, yeah, anyways, here's this. Ah, the item I requested. Your work is satisfactory. Here's your compensation. And also, this. Ah, you brought it. You've earned my gratitude and a $1,000 reward. Now go. Don't you dare tell me to go. I mean, I'll take the money. Uh, I, I seriously doubt he's gonna like flowers. I honestly, I honestly don't know what he likes. Oh, I already got two hearts from him for doing those two uh, quests. All right, good, but I still don't know what you like. Oh, that's, uh, whoops. There you go. 
You disliked the winter root and the fish I gave you. Hmm. All right, well. Well, since I'm two hearts with you, can I go in here now? Oh, what are you doing? I only allow those I trust to enter there. I guess not. Cool. Sorry, nine o'clock. Bunny. I think I pick up my axe tomorrow. I think that, that also means I lost my uh, refined quartz, but whatever. Uh, level six combat. All right, my HP increased by five. Uh, I can also make a slime egg press and I can oil garlic. All right, garlic oil. And I got quite a bit of money, nice. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, the fish. Oh no, spice berries give you quite a bit of money. Okay, never mind. Amaranth, ooh, those are good. I'm gonna be growing some melons in spring. Let's go. I'm gonna grow those melons. Let's do it. I'm gonna grow those melons. And what jelly was this again? Str salmon berry jelly, that's right. I guess I'll sell it. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. The spirits are in good humor today. Nah. I, I want to test something else out. Um, blackberry jelly, do I have a lot of blackberries? I do. All right, so the salmon berry jelly gave me 60. I wonder if blackberry jelly will give me 60 also. I want to test that theory. I got some stuff to pick up. All right. I want to tr test that theory if it's all jellies. Rufus, remember to eat healthy or you won't have enough energy to work hard. I'm including one of my favorite recipes. Make sure to use ripe tomato. <gasps> Spaghetti! All right. Starting tomorrow, a traveling merchant fleet will dock at Pelican Town for the yearly night market. The market starts at 5 p.m. and you will be in port and will be in port for the next three days. Please visit the beach after 5 p.m. to join the festivities. There's free coffee. That wouldn't that wouldn't incentivize me to go because I don't care for coffee, but I want to see what this is about. And also, I, I don't know if it said that the axe was ready, so I guess I'll just go check. And also it's Sunday, does that mean these, yeah, these go. So I'm still only five hearts with Emily. How did I get his up to three hearts? I feel like I barely even talked to him. Unless they never go away. Well, I guess if you give them a bad gift, they could.
All right, let's go see if my uh, axe is ready. There's a thing here. Snow yam. Holly. Got some hollies here. Are these like footsteps? Yeah, they are footsteps, but they last a lot longer than mine do. <laughs> yeah, the night market. It's uh, Harvey's birthday. Hmm. Oh yeah. You know, Harvey, for your birthday, I'll break my arm so you'll have something to do. I'm kidding. Hello, um, this weather's interesting today, don't you think? It's it's snow in winter. That's that's pretty normal. Oh, I got some copper ore, not bad. Yes, sorry, right, it is ready. Cool, got that. You received the steel axe. So that just leaves this, and the trash can. Got some books I need to read. A study on diamond yields. After years of research in the mines, I believe I've learned something about diamond frequency. My research involved only the stones that are scattered around the mines, the ones that are broken with a pickaxe. Mineral yields from other sources require more research. Diamonds seem to only farm at mine level 50 or greater. At level 50, approximately 1 in 500 stones will be diamond rich. After level 50, the frequency of diamond formation seems to increase by about 0 .000016 per level. Quite a rare gem. Wow. Ah, to brew. The rich smell of yeast wafting through a cedar loft, the floral overtones of freshly cut hops on a winter's eve. But I digress. You are probably more interested in the practical side of brewing. To brew, you will need a keg. I'll leave it up to you to devise blueprints for a keg. Kegs can be used to make several kinds of product. If vegetables are placed inside, the keg will produce juice. Juice takes the least amount of time to brew. If wheat is placed in the keg, it will produce beer. Beer takes a while to brew, but it is quite profitable. Placing hops in a keg will produce the beloved pale ale. Oh, here we go, hops in a keg. I get pale ale. Place fruit in the keg to make wine. Wine takes the longest of all to make, but a wine made from the finest fruit is worth quite a bit. Be patient with your keg. You'll know it's finished when it's uh, perfectly still. And only drink in moderation, or you'll surely regret it. Mystery of the Dwarves. I think this is what I, uh, what I need for that dwarf. The dwarves call themselves Smalawanu, which translates to sky people. An odd name for a group that lives deep underground, isn't it? Another mystery of the dwarves is the advanced technology that they supposedly possess. Evidence such as this had led me, despite the ridicule of my colleagues, to propose a new theory. I believe the dwarves are the remnants of a once advanced civilization whose interplanetary vehicle crashed on this planet long ago. I propose that this dwarvish spaceship bore down deep underground and over time the dwarves became adapted to their new underground environment. My colleagues ask, why didn't they come above ground and live on the surface? Perhaps their old planet had a thicker atmosphere that protected them from stellar radiation and they simply could not survive in our sunlight. That would explain why they only surface at night to take what they need from our houses. Huh. Uh, okay, so you can read these again. Can I be friends with Gunther by any chance? Is that even a possibility? No, it's not. It doesn't seem like you have anything to donate to the museum. Better get out there and do some treasure hunting, huh? I can't be a friend with you. 
at all? Oh, you can rearrange. All right. Once I find like more stuff, I can just like rearrange everything. I got a steel axe. Birthday, dude. Wow. Let me come back here and give you, uh, I spent $300 on this, but you seemed like healthy food, right? Oh, it's for my birthday? Thanks. I guess not. Eh. What about this? I know I can give you two gifts, right? You've already given a... Okay, never mind. Oh well. What's up, Pierre? How's it going? I can buy another apple sapling. If I was rich, the first thing I would do, the first thing I'd do would be to hire a maid and a chef. Really. I would travel, honestly. I mean, as a farmer on here, I guess I couldn't travel, but in real life, I would travel. I would go everywhere I could. Gotta have these geodes. I saw some silver star hollies. We can sell these too. And silver star crocus. Give me that money. I forgot I had these geodes because I was waiting on that steel axe to be done. Then I'll go to the beach and see if there's anything I can pick up. Maybe fish for a bit. Geodes. Here we go. What do we got? Dwarven helmet? Stones. Awesome. A stone. Okay, so I've already turned that one in. Bunch of messages on Discord. Alright. Oh, looky here. Nautilus shell. Muscle. I just love that. Da -da -da. Another book? Nope. Some clay. Oh, an anchor. Nice. Is that something I would have to turn into? Yep. That was quick. Could have been perfect.
There we go, perfect. Go turn that anchor to the museum. All right. Got a skeleton. Nice. If only I had a closet to put it in. of these I can sell. Start collecting those two. Winter root. Some coal, not bad. Can always use some coal. I had a tree up here. Or maybe they grew. Ooh, a chicken statue. Got another one. Can I put it down? Like, just lay it down somewhere? Like, I would just lay it in here. Be like, hey, I got a little chicken here. Excuse me. It's an artifact, so it goes in here too. Cool. I'm free to give Emily more gifts. Uh, given her an amethyst. She loved the amethyst and she loved the aquamarine. She hated the holly. That would make sense. So what haven't I given her yet? I haven't given her an earth crystal. Let's try that. And who else? I know uh, one of the... I know Sam usually hangs out in the bar. One of 
those two usually hang out. He hated the sna- Ah, oh, did I give him a snail at one point? <laughs> He also seems to like stones. I don't think I've ever given him an amethyst before. Uh, uh, shoot, Sam left. Sebastian over here at least? No. Dang it. Well, uh, let's give you an earth crystal. Emily, do you like this? Thank you, I'm feeling a positive energy for this gift. You like everything, except for the holly. That makes sense. Sebastian, are you here? I guess I could give Sam the amethyst. Nope. He's done for the night. Alright, let's give someone else the amethyst. I thought Sebastian would be there. Oh no, you usually hang out up here. Actually, come to think of it, where do you live? Okay, no, you're not up here, maybe? Or I guess you would be back home for the night, wherever that is. Snow yam. Abigail. Abigail, you want an amethyst? I seriously love this. You're the best. Awesome. <laughs> Don't eat it now. Okay, so this jelly gave me a little bit more blackberry. So the different jellies do give you different uh, prices. Uh, the sea urchin. Yeah, gold sea urchin gives you 240. That's right. That's a lot of money. Hollies give you a good amount. Man, everyone seems to hate them, but, you know, they're valuable, I guess. <laughs> All right. That's, I got some pretty good money. All right, this is going to be my last day of the stream, so what do we got going for day 15? Sunny day tomorrow? Spirits are very happy today. They will do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. Should I go to the mines? Because I did increase my defense a little, I kind of want to see how well that's going to work. I'll work on the farm in my, on my next stream. I will focus on that next stream, so. 
I'll take some of these with me, and I'll see how good my defense works with that, uh... With those shoes. <laughs> shoes. Give you some water. Yeah, you better love that. Any fruit before I go? food. All right, let's see how I do with my increased defense. doesn't. I'm still getting her a lot. That didn't seem to help. That didn't really seem to help. I'm still getting hurt a lot. I just gotta be careful. Oh, there's this guy. Got a gold ore out of that nice. just hurt and they don't flinch. Oh. I wonder if the other weapon... Oh, I'm gonna die. I died. I wonder if this sword makes them flinch. What did I lose? I found you unconscious in the mines. You're lucky I happened to pass by. Be a little more careful next time, okay? You I lost a thousand dollars in two items. Shoot. Oh, I lost all my tortillas and winter roots. Oh, I lost $370. So those boots didn't really help that much. Oh, and my energy's real low. That was a bad idea. I need to, I really need to figure this out. Because I won't be able to survive down there. I did lose a thousand dollars. Tell me I didn't. Oh, there's stuff over there. So those guys, they just don't flinch at all when you hit them. I wonder if the antlion sword makes them flinch, which means I probably should still pick up that, uh, that one sword. I know, Nisi. I'm sorry. I lost. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. She didn't like that I lost. <laughs> I know, right? I'm mad too. Okay, cool. At least I lost only food. I mean, I lost money, but like, as far as items go, at least I only lost food. So I'll have to do some science with that. Do the swords actually make them flinch? If that's the case, then I should probably just stick with the sword. No, Nisi, I'm sorry. I'll do better next time, I promise. <laughs> oh, there it is. Insect head. Man, I lost so much energy from that. No, that, you're, you're sad.
You okay? Did you get it all out of your system now? Don't worry, I'll do better next time, okay? <laughs> oh, Nisi. She's just getting cranky in her old age. <laughs> now you're staring at me because I said that. <laughs> uh, well, I guess I can start work on my farm then. I was going to do that for the next day, but, but I at the very least do need some energy. I can cook spaghetti now, which requires wheat flour and tomatoes. I can make sashimi, so I'll just go ahead and eat that. There we go, got some energy out of that. All right, I have an idea on how I want to... You also eat the plate? Yeah, my guy was just starving after he nearly died. I don't blame him. God, that sucked. I need, I need to figure out how to... I mean, I, there's the bombs, but that takes a while to uh, explode. I need to see if the... Uh, oh, that doesn't give you anything. I need to see if the swords do a better job of pushing them back, because they were not flinching or backing off when I would hit them, and that was pretty bad. What, what else was I looking for? Oh, I was looking for these. And I also need to learn how to make fences. I want to make some fences around it, too. And a gate. I just need a lot of wood. All right. All right, let's do this. Make that much and I'll make some more if I need it. All right. I'll hang on to the wood. All right, so I have an idea on what I want to do. make this go away. That won't work. Hmm. Well. One, two, three, four. And again, I don't know how to get rid of that. Okay, so one, two, three. Doing that creates those divots on the ground. All right, well, I need to stop doing that then. And just, no, I have to hit him. Come on, there you go. I mean, these also are in the way. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. And then once those disappear, I'll, I'll build over them. Is that too far? Hold on. One, two, six, seven. No, I think that I think that's not far enough. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, that's not far enough.
Oh, no, I need to make it bigger. Shoot. All right. It's all a work in progress. I do want to leave that there, though, so... No, wait, no. Let's... Actually, I don't think I need these. I think I just want to fence it in without the walkways. I've never done this before. I'm trying to figure it all out. I wonder if these can... If I could put these on top of those. What? What now? Are you mad at how I'm doing this? <laughs> oh, she's growling. Whoops. I'll fix that. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can grow over the uh, build over them. Cool. Also, the night market's open. So how do I open this? Just <laughs> so where's the little square supposed to be? It's not telling me that I could that I'm not far enough. All right. Let's go see what this night market's all about. That's kind of how I want to do it. I'll have to make some adjustments. And I'm sure come springtime, I'll, I'll make some final adjustments to it. I just want to, I mostly just want to like lay out how I want the farm to look. Come springtime when I can actually start planting the, the fruits and stuff, then, um, then I'll probably make final adjustments, but right now I just want to uh, design it. Hello there, for an upcoming promotion, I'm thinking of offering some high quality vegetables at a slight premium. Know where a thrifty shopkeep might find 25 gold star vegetables? I don't, I've been selling those, shoot. Hey, I have an idea for a new style of bed, but I'll need 80 hardwood to make it happen. Can anyone help? Now for this one, do I have to collect 80 or do I just have to have it? But And for this one, 25 gold star, I'll have to see what I have. It was down here, right? Oh, there's people here. These people are travelers like me. I feel a connection, but I'm okay with just staying here to watch, listen and watch. Wait, where are they? Oh, they're down here, okay. I'm taking a night off from the saloon for Jazz's sake. Aw. I wish I was old enough to see the mermaid show. There's a mermaid show? I gotta see this. This looks really cool. Ahoy there, want to take the deep sea fishing tour? It'll cost you a thousand dollars. No, not right now. I'll see what's going on around here first. Hey, do you sell bottles? I'm thinking of Link to the Past. Hello there, care for a cup of coffee? Well, it's free, right? Yay. You received a coffee. Hmm, smells great, doesn't it? It's mostly for the speed. That's why you that's why you wouldn't want the coffee. Oh, hello. A decorative piece for your farm. Wow, these are all pretty good price. Nothing like rare though. Hey Emily, how's it going? I think this boat's my favorite. It's so unique. It's purple. I think the Yeah, it's purple. I kinda like that. Abigail? This is so mysterious, I love it. Oh, hello. I can send you home for $250, I can walk. Can you smell that? The air is so spicy here. I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. Maybe the mermaid show will calm my nerves, but what if they think I'm ogling? Gulp. 
Hmm. A Lupini original. Not bad. Wait. Oh, the art. I'm selling this painting for $1,200. What do you say? Eh, no. Uh, yeah. Winter can be a dreary season, but events like this make it a little brighter. Oh, hello. Bug me for $600? Dude, I have like 20 of these. I don't know how many I actually have, but... Wow! 263 energy for $2,250. Man, if I knew how to make fruit salads in real life... Maybe like this? Dude. Plum pudding. Woodpath. I can make that on my own. Wow, you are... the. Oh, here's a rare crow. I'm trying to remember if this was a trophy to collect all these. Cause I, I know I already missed one, but I was gonna come. I was gonna pick it up next year. I might do the same for this one, cause I'm gonna come back and pick them up. Huh, the markup on these is ridiculous, though. Surprised to see me? I trade by sea too. The pig likes a good swim. Where's the pig? Oh, that piggy! Oh, hello. Here we go. Uh, gravestone, stone frog, a cone hat for $5,000, dude, parsnip seeds. Oh, you sell, uh, I do need to get started on picking up some seeds for spring. This is more important right now, actually. Um, oh, you have another rare crow here. I think I have that one. I do need to start picking up some uh, spring seeds. I don't think I have bean starters because I didn't grow beans last year, and that's the one thing I need. So I'll buy about five of these. I'm sure Pierre, actually, you know what, no. Let's buy 15, and I'm sure Pierre will sell them in spring. Cauliflower, we'll buy uh, 10 is 800, 20 is 1600, so that'll be, uh, 1200 for 15. Multiple potatoes during a harvest, that sounds good. Alright, well I'm getting my spring uh, shopping already done here. I don't know if these are marked up. I don't think they are, because those are like really cheap prices. Parsnip. I each day something new. Hmm. Not interested in the. Well, the. I mean, Emily would like those flowers. Did I get kale seeds yet? I haven't. I'll start focusing on those three right now, and then I, I guess when springtime comes around, then I can get more. But I just want to get started on collecting some seeds. Is this the mermaid show? Was I supposed to bring clams? Gotta keep an eye on the time. The time's still going. going on? I think I'm tripping out. Yay! That was pretty cool. Do I get anything for that? I want 
those shells. I want to take them home. That was so much fun to just uh, kick and do. That was interesting. Uh, I kind of want to see what this is, but a thousand dollars? It's already almost midnight. It should be there tomorrow, right? And if I miss it, oh well. That was, um, that was interesting. <laughs> I like that. That was really cool. It's getting late, I know. Now that I picked up those torches, it's like really dark. Now I'll keep them on me. It'll remind me that I'm actually working on this. These I could put up. See, so yeah, I have plenty of like. Well, this put them in order by like season. So like spring, some no summer. Oh, it puts them in order by alpha alphabetical. Can we put them in order by season? No. They didn't sell melon seeds. Okay. That's what I really want to grow. I really want to grow melons. Whew. Plant in spring or summer to grow a coffee plant. Place five beans in a keg to make coffee. Gonna be really busy on here these next few days. Start getting my farm set up. Yeah, I'll have to figure out how I want to do this. Oh, I didn't sell anything. Whoops. Oh well. Alrighty, that's gonna do it for me. Hope y'all had uh, fun today. It's, oh, I'm six hearts on Emily. Nice, I'm just two hearts away. And I guess that's when the relationship starts. Cool. All right, well, um, that's gonna do it for me. I hope y'all had a blast. I certainly did. It is getting cold here, so I'm gonna start turning on the heater and make me some food and get bundled up for the evening. So let's see who is online right now. We have... Uh... All right, Justly Belmont is playing some Kingdom Hearts 3, and if I recall, he is actually racing Neutral B. So, you know, uh, if you're not following uh, Justly Belmont yet, be sure to give him a follow. He is also uh, racing Neutral B in Kingdom Hearts 3. If you're not following Neutral B, then uh, give him a follow as well. So, awesome. This has been fun. I can't wait to continue with Stardew Valley. I'm starting to work on my farm, and yeah, we are got a lot of work to do now, now that I'm getting all that set up. I'm getting images in my head on how I want this farm to, to look. So... Alrighty, that's gonna do it for me, so, um, and, uh, I'll probably stream either Sunday or Monday, depending on how, how everything's going, so. Alright, that'll do it for me, take care everybody, and have yourselves a good one, bye bye